In commensuration on the loss, uh, what do you make uh, of the match today? And uh, do you think that it went into the second day, uh, changed the team's fortune? Um, okay, so it's a really good game of cricket. Um, just, put down, just put them down a little bit. Little bit okay. Okay. Um, it's, a, it's a really good game of cricket. In the end, it could have gone any way throughout the, um, the whole of India's innings. It could have gone either way. And it felt like at times we were in front of the game. Um, and a good over either for me, the team could just turn it. Unfortunately um, for India, or well, fortunately for India, Irfan Batan came in and batted incredibly well. Um, but it's a really, it's a really good game of cricket. Um, even for the to start yesterday and play today, the wicket still held up really well. So um, it was an even contest, and people watching here at the ground and also at home would have got a great, great crowd for it. What do you make out of the pitch today? Uh, did it change from yesterday, or was it the same? It's pretty similar. Like it was just, it was a little bit more. It's probably a tiny bit tackier last night, but things didn't really change too much. So for us to be able to get this game on uh, was re was really important to be able to play the the game and for us to get 20 overs um, out of the think? second innings as well with what? India was was great. Any comments about the ground and the spectators' crowds? Yeah, it's an incredible ground here for sure. Like the wicket, the wicket was really good. The outfield and the facilities here are excellent. The crowd came along even into day two as well of a T20 game. They came they came out as well and they were very loud towards the end. So it's Yes, it's great fun to be able to play here. Where did you think you lost the game? Was it Irfan Pathan or uh, Naman Oja? Uh, both. <laughs> um, both. Naman batted um, incredibly well, as, as he does. He's a very skillful very skillful batsman. And then Irfan just really took the game away from us. Um, Dirk Nannis has, has bowled very nicely in the back end of the game for us throughout this tournament. Uh, but Irfan was just too good tonight. The action ships from India to Australia for the T20 World Cup. What do you make of the T20 World Cup? And which are the favourites, according to you, Australia being the... Uh, defending champions. Yeah, well, India played very well here in um, in India um, against Australia. But Australia, for me, are the favourites. They're playing they're playing very good T20 cricket at the moment. The conditions are very different um, in Australia. The grounds are much bigger. Uh, the pace and the wickets are, are definitely a bit more as well. So um, I'd say Australia, the, the favourites at the moment, they are playing very good T20 cricket, and they'll make the most of the home conditions. There. Do you think that too, so many too many domestic cricketers are being played right now? Where? All over the world, domestic cricket, just like other sports, cricket has also been a boon up. Every country, everywhere, domestic crickets are being gaining up. In me, mean franchise tournaments. Sorry. Franchise tournaments. I'm not sure what you mean. Yeah, he's, 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 he's talking about domestic cricket, cricket like IPL or uh, yeah. is yeah, being boon. Yeah, just like boom. the road safety. Other yeah. or road safety. Are increasing day by day. Oh, they certainly are, because that's you know obviously what the fans want to see, um, and it's what the people want to come and see as well in the, in the crowd. So um, while there's demand there, there's always going to be cricket that's going to be played. Thank you. Thank you.